Each year, a select group of students are picked to receive one of the most prestigious academic awards of who's who among students. This year, 15 students were chosen due to their GPA being a 3.0 or higher and their leadership and service throughout their Cabrini experience. I was one of the recipients of the Who's Who Award this year because I'm part of the honors program at Cabrini. I was photo editor for Lokewater, our school campus newspaper, for two years. I was inducted into four honor societies during my time here. I also put in community service work uh, with my first year honor society and volunteered at Children's Hospital. Um, lastly, I'm graduating summa cum laude, which means I have a GPA over 3.9. I was a peer mentor. I am a part of the Phi Alpha Honor Society. Oh, I volunteer at Phil Abundance, and I also volunteer and do uh, PB&J nights every Wednesday um, at Urban Art Gallery down in Philly. Some of my involvements <laughs> include campus ministry, working in the Writing Center as a peer tutor, um, different honor societies, including being president of Phi Sigma Iota, International Foreign Language Honor Society. Uh, went on the Swaziland trips and also the uh, Argentina trip. I have been an RA for the past three years here at Cabrini University. Uh, it is an enjoyable experience. I've loved it. Um, the second is service. I've done a variety of service trips here at Cabrini through campus ministry. Um, I'm, ready, I'm very active in the community and the geriatric population in which I want to serve. And as far as leadership service and scholarship, you know, I'm in several honor societies. Being involved in campus ministry as a liturgical minister, um, I've also been a leader in the Cabrini PSEA club. I've also been a classroom coach and I've been involved in multiple honor societies. My reaction when I found out that I actually got the Who's Who Award, I opened it and I read the email probably three to four times uh, with my mouth just kind of open really wide. I was really in shock and um, I sent a picture to my mom right away. I was really excited. I was actually at my internship when I found that I you know, received the Who's Who Award award uh, by another recipient, Jordy, Jordan Floyd. Um, shout out to Jordy. She uh, actually sent me a screenshot of it. I was like, oh, you look, we got it. And I'm like, wow. And then I'm the only guy, too, to receive it. So I, f I thought that was a bit shocker, too. So I was excited. I was really surprised, and it was very humbling, I guess I should say, because I, I didn't believe I would get the award. It, it was so-so, like I thought I would get it, but then on the other half I'm like, there's so many other great students at Cabrini that deserve it as well, but to learn that I received it was like the biggest accomplishment of my life. I was really excited, um, felt very honored. Um, also felt kind of funny <laughs> because it almost seemed like getting an award for something that should be second nature. Um, just to be involved and to serve others is just something I've always always done. Um, so it felt a little bit funny in that way, but it was good. I was very humbled to know that I've been recognized for all my leadership and service at the college. Receiving this award means being a part of a family and a community that is Cabrinian, but also national too. It just really um, makes me proud of all the hard work that I put in at Cabrini over the last four years. When I came to Cabrini, I was never really one that was a leader or stood out. Um, I, know I was never in honors courses in high school. Uh, I just kind of did the bare minimum. But when I came to Cabrini, I really stepped outside of my comfort zone and um, this award just like makes that really worth it in the end. Receiving this prestigious award um, it makes me want to be the change that I wish to see in our world. It's nice to know that I'm among a lot of my peers that I look up to and admire.